All right, this is one last midnight coming back to you with another episode of Astroneer. So we're all waiting for the Maple update. <laughs> it was supposed to be April. No, it's May. So it's April. It's a Maple update. Well, there's been some interesting news coming out. Let me just update you guys here. Oh, hold on. Sorry about that interruption. Uh, all right. So the Maple update is comprised of a lot of things, right? So there's some optimization to the foliage power system, large number of objects in the world. They're going to uh, hopefully fix all that, resolve all that. Uh, tether system part two optimization is coming out. The new plant features in Calador, Visania, and Glacio are coming out. The customization preview, which is um, the ability to be able to see what your suit color is and your emotes are before you put it on. You actually put it on. Um, the extra large platform and the extra large shredder, which can't wait to get my hands on that. The shredding of uh, large objects and uh, some balances for research costs and resources and overall bytes per minute gain. Okay, so that was that was supposed to be in April. Now it's in April, so part of April, part of May, right? Granted, it's now the May update because it is May, but at any rate, no big deal. It's coming out. So. There's been some postings that have been happening. And uh, Joe has uh, put out one with interesting new free the, ball, free the ball. So the Leo and Checker balls are now uh, going to be in plain sight coming back to the game. Uh, I don't I don't quite know how to comment on the whole free the balls. Uh, should we be calling this the commando update? <laughs> There's also going to be a full release next week. And so what they're doing this week, though, is they're releasing a public test build. So there's a, a public test release that's going to be released, hopefully today. The word is it's today, Thursday. So if you're watching this on the 2nd, May 2nd, it's supposed to be today. Don't know when, don't know if it's going to make today or not, but that would, that's the scuttlebutt. Opting in is you've got to go to uh, Steam, you've got to go to the properties of the game, you need to go to the uh, beta section and then you need to select that drop down. It's got, it's got, I think it's going to be called the EFT in the drop down. This is got, that's what the name of it is going to be, it's EFT. And once you do that, then you're, you'll wind up downloading that version and you can play that version. If you want to switch back to the normal version, you just opt out and you go back to the normal version. Right? So that's, that's how it, it's pretty much the way any other game works if you're uh, to be able to switch from versions to version. So the big thing is, you know, the extra large shredder, which supposedly we're going to be able to shred very large objects. You know, it does say make sure that vehicles are unoccupied. So does that mean we can shred a shuttle? Ooh, that would be interesting, right? And then the extra large platform for this extra large shredder is also going to be something new. And that, that is going to be very cool to see. So... Hopefully we stay on top of this. Hopefully we get it out today. If we do get it out today, we'll wind up streaming it today. And um, oh, so what? So what else? What else is going on? Oh, uh, I sent over a care package over to System Era, and uh, it seems like everything arrived safely from Chicago to Seattle. So I uh, hope you enjoy uh, everything that's in there. And Joe, I hope you uh, share the coffee mugs and Space Nail rules, man. Yeah, if you haven't already, hit that like button. If you're not subscribers, please subscribe. And uh, if you want to follow me on any of my social media, the links are in the description below. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.